Hello and welcome back to the another video of Python 2020. In this video, we are going to see the uses of OpenPY Excel. And this is the first video of a multiple video series on OpenPY Excel. So in this first video, what we are going to see is how can we loop on each row in a Excel sheet using OpenPY Excel. And in OpenPY Excel, how can we read data from the cells to variables? And then we will see how can we write back the data into the Excel cells. So before I go ahead, I would like to tell you more details about this playlist. So this is the first video that we are going to see now. And this is the second video where we will see how to apply formula and how to do calculations in OpenPY Excel. In the third video, we are going to see how can we apply color and style in OpenPY Excel and how can we apply conditional formatting like color scale and highlight duplicate all those things and in the fourth video we will see how can we create different kind of charts using open py excel so subscribe to the channel for more videos and if you like the content of this video please hit the like button a like button is a real support for youtube channel so now let's start today's video so here i am on my uh, pycharm code editor I have already installed OpenPY Excel using this command in the terminal. And if you are not aware how to create Python environment and how to use Python, you can find the link in description. But for now, let's start this code here. So I will add a new file. And the first step is that we have to import the OpenPY Excel library and then we have to initialize our data from the Excel. And then we have to tell OpenPY Excel that on which sheet you want to work upon. So for these three things, you, you can see the code right now on your screen. So in, the, in this line number three, I am loading the Excel into a variable and, and then I am using load workbook function. And I have assigned that and I have assigned the output to one variable that is data file. Okay, so let me show you the data also. So here is the data for your reference, and these are the values. And sheet one, all right. So now we have the data sheet, we have the data file. How can we so how can we assign the data? So, so first of all, we have to create one uh, loop. So to create the loop, this is the line. So row number is the numerical index of the row and row value is the data of the row all right now within the loop what we have to do is we have to read the data into a variable based on the row and column so you can see i have added three lines of code so row i have taken row number which is here plus two because in excel row will start from one and in loop row will start from zero so that is why we need plus two and then column i have given and then value so value we are assigning to a variable order id same way we are doing for column three customer name so you can write any variables here so order id and customer's name all right and then i am simply printing the uh, row here so row number you can see here row order id and customer name okay. so i will just run this code first so you can see the row number is starting from zero that is why we have added two here so that we can read correct value customer one you can see the customer name is customer one and the id is this have a look here now let's come here and you can compare the output from here all right now next is how we will write the data back so for that we need in which column we have to write the data column 11 so what i will do simply i will just from date time code date time i will add the code for date time what i am doing i am converting the date to uh, the format if you want you can leave it as it is and then also it should write And once you have assigned and you have written the output, you have to create a new file also, or you have to save the same file. 
So how, how will you save the output file in OpenV by Excel? So you are updating the sheet of this sheet itself. Okay. And then this sheet belongs to this data file variable. So we have to save the same data file. All right. Now let's run. If you want, you can save the data file in the end of after looping on all the rows also. So I will just run it and let's see. It is completed. And so here is the output file saved. Let's open the file and see. So you can see the date and time is written here. All right. So you can just change this header. It is a simple thing. I hope you can see the entire code on your screen for how to loop on each row of Excel and how to read the data from the Excel cells and how to write data to the Excel cell using Open PY Excel. For more videos, how to apply formula, how to calculate and then write the result how to apply conditional formatting, how to create graphs. So these all videos are coming in. Subscribe to the channel, hit the like button. Thank you very much for your time.